beneficiary of her predisposition. As opposed to creating a thing for her. Let me just go and approach this girl and uh, see what happens. Oh shit. You have to be physically fit. <laughs> you have to be advanced enough to walk backwards at a certain, at a model's pace, right? In fact, I tell guys not to stop on their back foot, so to say, off balance. I tell guys to stop. But here, I intentionally went in and did a backwards run, which is immediately acknowledging that I know I'm doing some, some form of approach to a girl who's seen everything. That's a nice smile. Will you do me a favor? If, so as soon as I came around her and I looked at her and she saw me, she was like, seen this before, no. She had that look on her face like, right? Then I started going backward still and then smiling at her without talking. And she smiled back. Why is that? Why did she smile back? Why is that effective? Because I'm not playing the game. In order to have a war, they say, two people have to agree on the conflict, right? If we don't agree on the conflict, you're not gonna have a war. We both have to agree that we want this piece of land. If one person says, you know what, I don't really care, and then of course, how can they be angry at me? It's very obvious, and there are better examples of this, but agreement, isn't that contradictory? Will you do me a favor? If there is a person or a wall, you tell me. I'm sorry, but I don't speak English. No, I speak English. Oh my God, I run from McDonald's, I see you. In order for her to hate me, I would have had to do what normally guys do. So in this sense, the agreement is, I want to stop you and she, I don't want to be stopped. So that's the agreement on what the problem is. Here, I eliminated the problem by creating a new world of entertainment, of playfulness that she was so unfamiliar with that she couldn't fight it. She had nothing to fight, there was no conflict. So instead, she smiled and just was like, that's a nice smile. Will you do me a favor? There was no agreement on the status quo, the normalcy of an approach. Guy wants girl, girl's not sure and protective about herself in relation to guy. Look, this is one of the most uh, pickup artisty streets in the world. And this model gets stopped a million times if the guys have enough courage to do it. And she had that look of, I know, uh, revulsion, of disgust on her face. And then I was like going back. And instead of playing the game, talking the language of war, excuse me, you're so beautiful, the language of war, <laughs> excuse me, you're so beautiful, I said something unexpected. Will you do me a favor? If there is a person, or a wall, you tell me. You're gonna tell me, right? If there's something, let's agree. We have to agree to this. If there's something behind me, you better tell me if I'm gonna hit it. So in this way, suddenly, there was my complete and utter, I don't give a fuck about the normal game. I'm sorry, but I don't speak English. No, speak English. Oh my God, I run from McDonald's, I see you, and I'm McDonald's, I see you, and I say, oh, and I run. I discharged myself from the normal grammar of approaching. The new language was created, so we had a new language. She also said she didn't speak any English, and instead of doing any other thing, oh, do you speak a little English or whatever, 
I just used total animation. The animation was running. I was there, McDonald's. I see you and I run. I was visually showing with my hands. I was there. Oh, old man, old man. And now, oh, old man. She laughed. She liked that. And I said, did the secret stop move? She stopped. I say, hello, nice to meet you. My name, Andrew. Adele. Oh, Adele, hello. Yeah. And you have name or no name? No name. No name. <laughs> Just like, you know, in Africa, they have sometimes name like... Yeah, it it's like, like this. <laughs> Me too, I'm African. Okay. Hello. Nice to meet you. I go to my friend, but I, f I send you text message and we fall in love. Okay. Maybe fall in love. In my experience, which is not insignificant, um, a girl who is uh, go away to a guy and with a friend who has the habit of saying uh, go away, the best thing is to make a strong impression, get the number and leave. Okay? Rather than continuing on in an approach mindset, especially with she's with her friend in that way. I have no doubt that I have a strong impact on her. Uh, I said, let me get your number. She didn't have any resistance. There was no Facebook or Instagram. She just gave me her number. She was definitely flattered. I met her, I approached her and talked to her from the place of, I get that you're approached by guys. I get that you just want peace. I get that you're just a human. And so I will acknowledge that even, it was spontaneous for me to do that. I'm acknowledging her in that way at a very automatic level. Immediately, I'm not seeing her as unreachable, unattainable. I'm immediately seeing her, and you don't feel she's a human unless you can feel deeply you're a human. And this requires that you get into the awareness level of your being, your emotional level of your being, so that you can relate to other people's emotional being and your physical level of being. Cultivate your sexuality, your male intention, your power which supports that male intention, your heart or your sense of goodness, which allows for your power and intention not to be shameful or sexist or predatory because you know your goodness and insofar as you know your goodness, you understand the other person's goodness or their desire for goodness, and you don't violate their need for relatable experience and goodness. And then your expression, how you speak from your heart in relation to that integration, and then your understanding, which unifies it all, where it's all unified, each feeds the other, in not regarding the girl as outside, as unattainable, as overwhelming, you speak, you find a new language, a new contact point, a new connection point that isn't about the war, about the two. And duality is two, two sides, right? So here, I had a completely non-dual approach to the expected. The expected being the binary of man wants girl, the duality of man wants girl. Okay, so our three qualities of being, awareness, emotion, physical sensation, feeding and being fed by the six and five or six, depending, um, qualities of fundamental consciousness or relational attunement or human.